I believe that man is still in an intermediate stage between the animal and the divine. It is still in a stage of evolution. And to be able to take part in that evolution, to be able to cooperate with that evolution, I think is probably the noblest thing that we can do in our lives. There is a beautiful verse by Alama Iqbal, Khudi ko kar buland itna ke har takdeer se pehle, Khuda bande se khud poochhe bata deri rizha kya hai. That khudi ki bulandi, raising the level of consciousness, which is really the goal of yoga, I believe that that is the greatest goal that we can have in our lives, and that is something which every human being should adopt. You know, it seems to me to be self-evident. Who are we, denizens of a tiny speck of dust in this illimitable cosmos, to lay down that the immutable, illimitable divine can appear only at this time and in this place and in this form? India has affected the world in many ways. Indian architecture and Indian culture spread throughout the whole of South and Southeast Asia. In modern times, India has influenced the world through Gandhiji. 